the easiest way to come to Qatar now. Welcome back to this channel. Thank you so much for subscribing. Thank you so much for the support. We are looking at around 1,000 subscribers. Support this channel by subscribing and pressing by the Don't forget to press the bell icon to be the first one on uploading video. Thank you so much. The returning subscribers, thank you so much for the support. I really appreciate it. For the new subscriber, please consider subscribing to this channel. Don't forget, it's Meg's creation. Support this channel by subscribing and pressing the bell icon. You will always be the first one when I upload your video. In today's video, we are looking at the easiest way to come to Qatar right now. Remember, we talk about opportunities. We are talking about opportunities in 2022. We have Qatar is hosting the FIFA World Cup 2022. There's a lot of opportunities. By the way, did you know that Qatar needs over a thousand security guards, a thousand cleaners, a thousand delivery people, a thousand construction, a thousand technicians? Then, if you've heard of that, this will be the golden opportunity for you to start right now. By looking at that golden opportunity, that golden job, or that opportunity that you feel you've been looking for. Remember, there's a lot of opportunities right now. Right now speaking, we are closing off the year. We only have 31 days left to close up this year. And what does it mean? It means that starting next year, starting next year, we shall have the year of the FIFA World Cup in Qatar. The clock is now ticking. The clock is now ticking. It is now 353 days left. It is now a few days left for those golden opportunities for you to have. But remember, we talked about in the video how to start. You should start right now. Start to look for that opportunity. That opportunity, look for it. Look for it now. How do you start? We talked about the four ways of how to look for this opportunity. I talked about in the video where I talked about the five easiest jobs for you to come in Qatar right now. You have too many opportunities. You have very many recruitment companies in your country, in those areas that you are coming from. But remember, it is better to start the chance right now, to start up right now, by going to those recruitment companies. Yes, there's an opportunity. In this video, let us try to see what is the best way for you to come to Qatar right now. Remember, when I talk about the best way, don't fail to talk about what you call migrations. We shall not fail to discuss about what you call the COVID pandemic and its disastrous effects to the global economies. Companies, countries have been looking up. There's a lot of travel restrictions every single day. A lot of travel restrictions keep on changing every single moment of day, every, every hour. Why is this happening? Because each country is trying to see how it can protect its citizens or how it can try to protect its population from the daily, the, the deadly pandemic. So you expect that there will be restrictions every time and day. You never know. It may be after three months that you are planning to apply for a job in Qatar or any Gulf country. It may be after two months that you are up, you, you're planning to have this opportunity, to start up this opportunity. That's when the restriction will be coming. But the close, you cannot come, even if the opportunity is there with you. That's why I keep on telling people, it's better you start now. It's better for you to start. Let us start right now, my brothers and sisters. Let us try to start ourselves. If we are to meet up, if we are to chase our long-term and short-term dreams and long-term programs and projects and plans we have, is better we start right now. Right now, the only easiest way to come in Qatar is through what we call work visa. Most of you lack room with me, but that is my easiest way to come right now. Because why? Because there are a lot of opportunities out here. There are a lot of recruitment companies there recruiting people to come. 
It doesn't matter how you come. What matters? Have you started? It is what matters. The question is, have you started? Start with what you have. The rest will come after. And that's what I'm talking about. It is what we call through the work visa. We talked about the types of the visas in the, the one of the videos. I will provide the link below. We talked about the types of the visas. When you talk about the types of visas, there are different types of visas. Well, self, uh, self sponsorship, business visa, we talk about catalyst visa, we talk about uh, family visa, but all those are whole type of Why all those ones are coming to becoming a little bit harder in one way because of the restrictions. And if you're not vaccinated, it's a little bit worse. I can tell you. But let me just give you the benefits of the work. How, what are we talking about? We are talking about a situation whereby right now is that the opportunities that are there right now is that someone will sponsor you. You will pay up in case there is quarantine. You pay up quarantine in the given country. Or let's say, for example, you're coming to Qatar here. We are looking at FIFA World Cup. Your sponsor will pay up everything. That means you only have to come and maybe if you depending on how you upgrade, you can pay later. But you're already coming, you're already inside, you've already taken up that opportunity. No. You don't need to pay transport, he'll give you the ticket. In case some of are giving the ticket, leave alone these recruitment agencies. Some will give you the ticket, someone will give you the quarantine packet. So the only the only thing that is needed of you is coming, presenting yourself and taking up the opportunity. So when you come, that means you've started up the opportunity. But if you are going to use what you call a visa visa, it's a little bit harder right now for you to use what you call a, a visa visa. Because you'll need quarantine, you need a given amount of money. And if you're not vaccinated, they will need two doses of vaccine, approved vaccine, and you're not vaccinated. How are you going to stay in the country? They will not allow you in the immigration to come into the country. If in case you got that opportunity and you have a waiver somewhere, you'll still have to go to a hotel. Remember, in two days for the hotel here in Qatar, you'll, you'll even spend $275. That's my hotel for two days. But remember, it will depend on the number of days that you go to stay in the hotel. If, say, for example, you're coming from the red list countries, that means you'll have to take up quarantine, self-supported quarantine of seven days. So that means you have to pay up all those bills. And again, another thing is, how are you sure that you're going to get in a job that you're going to cover up the money that you very fast? Because remember, your visa needs to be changed to the work visa in case you get a sponsor. That means you'll have to, for the work for the visa visa, that means you'll get someone to sponsor you. You'll first have to exit the country. For you to, to get that visa, you exit the country, then you make a new entry. But remember, all those are costs at one. But if you get a company that is sponsoring you right now, take the opportunity. Go to those manpower companies, go to those recruitment agencies, try to ask the available opportunities. If there is a small input that you can try to put in for you to come, come, take in the input, come. After a few months or six months, you'll have to pay back or you have to recover whatever you have. But when you have someone that is sponsoring, and that person that will be sponsoring you, it will, the only way to sponsor you is by the work visa. By that person sponsoring you the visa. Remember, some of us go to those recruitment agencies, but we don't take it serious. Go with that CV that beats the rest of the people. Go with that CV that you feel, for example, if you're going for a security job, if you want a security job, right, make that CV that really beats out the rest. Show that you have even those additional skills that can enable you. That can inspire or that can motivate your employer in one way. Some of you, you go for those interviews by the manpower. But you don't feel like you've, done, you've not done enough. You will not get your opportunity. Go well prepared. Because most of the interviews, sometimes most of the interviews are on Skype. Someone will observe you will observe your affairs, will observe your, 
Your responding to the questions being asked, and how probably you do you 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 do you, you present yourself. They will get you on some of those these things to give you the visa. But try out to those recruitment companies also. Go to those agents, ask them if there's an opportunity. If the opportunity is starting as a cleaner and the one that is available, get it right now. Because remember, there are closures of borders. Remember, there are closures of restrictions, travel restrictions. What about if you not start today and you want to start the next month and there's a lot of travel restrictions? That means you cannot come. That means you've missed a good Hope, guys, I'm very clear. Hope you've shared something. So tell the brothers out, for those that are people planning to come, for those people that are planning to come in any way. The only opportunity right now to have a share of the cake, to have the sh- about to have the share of the opportunities that are available now, is to do what we call the work. Hope I'm right. Hope it is something that we are trying to get it right. Because you are assured that everything will be catered. There is nothing that you need to spend. Everything will be catered. Thank you so much for subscribing to this channel. Thank you so much for tuning in this video. Thank you so much for watching this video. And remember, I have to, uh, to remind you, we are looking at about 1,000 subscribers. It's only subscribing and clicking the bell icon or the notification bell that we are able to reach the 1,000 subscribers. And it's the only way that you will be notified when I upload a new video for this channel. Don't forget, please watch at least two minutes of this video because remember, we are looking at about 1,000 subscribers. Don't forget to put a comment in the sub section below. Tell me what you liked about the video. Tell me what you want us to talk about in the video. That is the only way. We have to share the information. Share with our brothers and sisters. It's the only way to improve ourselves, improve our brands, and improve our, the opportunities what we have. Don't forget to subscribe. It's made from the Inspiration TV. See you again in the next video.